I must say, I meet a lot of people in the news business, and you are truly the brightest light I have ever met. Oh. I mean it. You are. You are. You are. You are. You have just this. You emanate light and hopefulness and kindness, and so thank you. I mean, this is really an honor for me to be on your show. Oh my gosh, I, 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 who? Okay, <laughs> thank you. And there's I, a lot of pain out there in the world. We need people like you. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Well, that door is I think. Part of why I admire you so much is because you're able to carry people through that real pain in real time and how you're able to be the person that conveys the difficult things that happen in the world and find the hope by the end and the strength and be the warmth and the safety in to moments that don't feel safe or are devastating to hear, if that's not a human art, I don't know what is, Nora. So thank you for being you. Um, well, I think this is gonna be a story close and near and dear to uh, Ross's heart, but Nora O'Donnell, please take, her, take it away. I'm writing right. two of my favorite things, Nora O'Donnell yes. and, and the story. I know. So People reports that Cher says her secret to staying young is wearing jeans and keeping her hair long. <laughs> She's 77 years old. Wow. She's not ready to give up her signature long hair. It is beautiful. If you had hair like that, I mean, if I did, I'd keep it that long. Mm -hmm. um, and she says age should not impact how you think about yourself. And she says, I'm not trying to feel young. I am who I am. I'm just getting along. Preach, Cher. Preach. And she looked incredible. And she, you know what else? She just looks so confident. And, you know, like jeans and long hair. Thanks for sharing, <laughs> Cher. Honestly, because she can turn back time. Have you yes. noticed? Her boyfriend is like 40 years younger than her, too. Ooh. So it is working. Get it, girl, if you can. No wonder she feels young. Yeah. I, <laughs> I, <laughs> right? I mean, you know, I... <laughs> Cher is someone that, like, I have not known life or the world yeah, without. Totally. Like, when was the last time any of us didn't have, like, Cher at the epicenter of, like, fashion and pop culture? Mm -hmm. And, you know, I mean, it's like bring in Cher and her Bob Mackie totally. outfits, <laughs> make the world more colorful, what she would do with Sonny and Cher, what she's done through the 80s and 90s, and here she is. It's funny, the thing about I'm not trying to be young, it's like age is not really indicative of who you are. I know older people who are so immature and young people <laughs> totally. who are so wise. And it's like where you're at and how you feel. Like, do you, either of you feel a certain age? Do you feel timeless? How do you feel? Well, I'm turning 50. God, you're hot. Oh my God. You are so 50. hot, Nora. I always tell you that. And I guess, you know, my mom says the great thing about getting older is you care less what people think about you. Mm. So that's good. Yeah, that is good. Um, I've heard that. I also start, I do feel like age does, I mean, this, people say this, but it comes with a lot of wisdom and confidence. You do gain that over time. Yeah. I do feel like I'm getting... That way, finally. Better. Better. What about you, Rossi? I, I feel like I'm pretty hip, but then the other day my hip started hurting. <laughs> and I, I looked in the mirror and my hair was gray and now I have to tinkle in the middle of the night and I don't know, I feel <laughs> like I know all the songs on the radio, but it's, it's ticking, you know, <laughs> it's getting older. And yeah. I always tell you this, so we have years of footage to go back and corroborate this, but you've never looked better either. Like you so. love a silver fox, you do. <laughs>